Hi friends, I'm your Jessica. This week we are only focusing on cryptocurrency based companies and the company which we are going to see today is Umo. This company mostly uses original blockchain DApp system. It also uses smart contract with multiple metrics. As like Fosich, this company uses some same principles, but this company doesn't have decentralized This company uses Ethereum as their cryptocurrency like Fosich. This company that is Umo uses X3 and X4 levels, but more than Fosich, it uses X3 manual and X3 automatic, X4 manual and X4 automatic. This company also says that it uses spillover concept. This concept works well when our appliner works well. To join in this company, we have to invest 0.1 Ethereum. The 0.1 Ethereum subdivides into four categories, and one among the four categories, that is 0.025, goes for the X3 manual. To complete this X3 manual, we have to refer three people, and the third one's income will directly go for our upliner. Another 0.025 goes for the X4 manual. In this, we have to refer two people, and that two people should refer another two people. Those two people's income will only come to us, and the ones whom we referred, that income will directly go for our appliner. This is one of the drawback in this company. The leftover two 0.025s goes for. X3 and X4 automatic. This automatic works in the principle when our appliner refers more people, then our income directly increases. The positives and negatives in this Umo companies are the positives of this company is this company uses smart contract with blockchain. If the appliner works well, then we get more income. This company also uses Ethereum as the cryptocurrency, which is of good value in the future. The negatives in this company are: this company does not use decentralized, and this company does not show the direct referrals income. Get eligible in order to fill. A appliner should refer more people. The main disadvantage in this company are. When this company had launched, it gave more promotions, and after two hours, it gained three thousand IDs. But at the same night, this company had some website problem. So the company said that it will update soon and will do some website maintenance. But after one week, it has lost almost every ID. Website maintenance in this company is very much poor. The Umo company's ratings had gone very low, so the rating which I give for this Umo company is only four out of ten. So stay tuned, friends. In the upcoming video, I will tell you about more companies and its ratings. And bye from Jessica.